Pittsburghers always come together when times are tough, especially in 2020. And tonight we want to introduce you to a local nonprofit that's raising money and spreading smiles one family at a time. Here's Channel 11 Morning News anchor Catherine Amenta. It's, you know, one, one step of trying to get back to uh, where we were a couple of years ago, where we're not thinking about medicine every night. In a year that was so difficult, the Caparelli say they have so many reasons to be thankful. Even four-year-old Nora couldn't wait to share the wonderful news. Guess what? Guess what? This what? is the last chemo and last final pack. Everybody in the whole city is so happy for you to and thank you. Thank you. Pittsburgh first met Nora last year, right here on Channel 11. Can you say hi? When she took center stage at the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society's Light the Night. In 2018, Nora was diagnosed with ALL, or acute lymphoblastic leukemia. But now, a year later, her treatment is almost finished. A bell ringing, a bell ringing on January 14th. After Nora rings that bell at UPMC Children's Hospital, marking the end of treatment, it's time to celebrate in Disney, courtesy of a group of Pittsburghers with such big hearts. Disney World! Disney World! Nick and Ian bought us this big um, playing car to, to make a trip to Disney. Ian Coyle is the founder and president of the local nonprofit Semper Gratis, which means always grateful. And his team organized this big surprise of an all expense paid trip and a truck full of toys for Nora, her big sister Addie, and mom and dad. We want to be able to give back to as many people as possible, influence as many people as possible. Ian's mission started five years ago as a DJ. A buddy of mine joked that, you know, you're eventually going to run out of friends that you're going to DJ weddings for. What are you going to do next? What he did was start an organization that centers around his love of live events and raises money for causes all across Pittsburgh, including childhood cancer. To date, they've raised $100,000. He's the epitome of kindness. I and mean, it's not just with our family. He's been doing this, you know, for several years now, and his organization just keeps growing. If people are able to see the good, they want to be involved in some form or fashion or go out and pay it forward for others to be good. And now Ian says he can't wait for 2021 and hopefully the return of live events so their work can keep growing. I can't wait. You know, and I can only hope that our impact is bigger and better and better. As for Nora, 2021 is about health, happiness, and of course, <laughs> Disney. I, I wish you could be there too. Oh my goodness, Nora. Thank you so much. In Pittsburgh, Catherine Amenta, Channel 11 News. And if you would like to learn more about how to help Ian and his team, we have all the information up on our website, WPXI.com.